Housekeeping. I'm fine. In fact, I told the front desk that I don't want to be disturbed now or later. Sorry, sir. Helen, how long are you going to keep doing this? Dragging me around the country and drugging me. Okay, you know what? Go ahead. Go ahead, do it. Just go ahead and do it. Drug me one more time. What the hell do I care? Because you know what? I will never, never stop dreaming of Zach. I will only dream of Zach. I told you that if there's proof that Madison is in trouble, I would help. So now you're a believer? Uh, you and Erica helped me get there. Look, I'm really sorry that I gave Madison's dad that key. I, I honestly believe that he was being truthful, that she was delusional. Well, you thought you were helping her. Or I wanted her gone out of our lives. Because of that, because of me, she could have been hurt even worse. But she wasn't. And now she'll be protected. Safe. Let's keep our family safe, too, right? What do you remember about the night your brother was killed? Every single detail. I stood outside that window, hating the world and myself. My brain addled with drugs and despair. I just wanted to end it. So I pulled the trigger. And you shot your brother by mistake? Yes, yes. What happened next? I figured I should get out of there. So I ran. My <laughs> head full of drugs and fear. I was a mess. That's when you found me. And what did I do? Well, you, you told me to calm down. You uh, told me that everything was going to be all right. and took me to the attic. Ask me. Go ahead. Did you know in that moment you had shot your brother? Yes, yes. And I, I figured uh, I needed a plan. <laughs> and that's when you appeared, and I figured everything was falling into place, so I just denied knowing anything about it, and you calmed me down and uh, helped me, and um, I guess it worked out, uh, didn't it? Objection. Who's questioning whom? So you used me? Oh, yes. Most people thought that um, you were using me. The poor, this poor, uh, well, a sort of hopeless grandfather type, madly in love with a young, beautiful temptress. Do you ever think about telling anybody that you had killed your brother? Oh, yes, yes. I, I came close to telling you many times because of Emma and Kendall going off to prison. When all this happened, I had fallen in love with you. And uh, I was much too selfish to sacrifice my own happiness for the greater good. So you don't think I am guilty of these charges no, against me? Of course not. Of course not. How could you be? How, how could you know I lied about the memory loss? All you did was love me. And from that night to this moment, you have loved me, and I love you for it. Mrs. Chandler. Sorry. Um, no further questions. You may step down. Oh, no, you can't. Need I remind you that you're under oath, sir? Yes, indeed I am. Then tell me this. Are you telling the truth, Mr. Chandler? And think carefully before you answer. Are you telling the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but? So help you God.